guys thanks for coming back um i put a video on youtube um regarding the test fit of the carbon fiber rooftop spoiler um this product product here um this is what came with that roof spoiler um i didn't get the chance to put it in because i was unwittingly cut off but uh, that roof spoiler is they, they normally come with this double sided sticky tape um this is a very cheap and nasty version um it's unbranded and if i've got to be honest with you it's absolutely useless it's not adequate enough for sticking down um, a carbon fiber roof spoiler that's of some value uh the the reason being is if anybody wants to rip that spoiler off the back of your car on a nice hot warm day when the adhesive has loosened up on this that boot spoiler will come straight off um, so basically that's getting through away and it's not getting used what I will use which did come with a spoiler is these adhesion promoter pads um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to clean both surfaces with these pads and then what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be using Tiger Seal now there is an alternative to this which is an even better tape than this which is the branded 3M tape um, the 3M tape is normally on the size when you look at it it's normally black tape um, with the red cover on um, and the black 3M tape is a lot stickier and it has more adhesion power than what this tape does um, the 3M is a lot better product but I would still not use it um, what I would use is this stuff here I would use the Upol Tiger Seal it's a sealant and adhesive and quite a lot of manufacturers use this stuff um, this has been around since the 80s um, obviously I'm 56 year old and in the 80s with the uh, old RS and XR models of the Fords um, they used to use this for sticking body panels on which is the plastic wheel arches the plastic side skirts and um, this has really good adhesion power the previous video I put on with a test fit of the spoiler I showed you that there was a carbon fiber M4 style boot spoiler now that boot spoiler was put on with this stuff previous to that there was the M style boot spoiler was standard that was also put on with blackjack with BMW the problem is is when you go to remove something that's stuck with this it leaves quite a bit of damage behind that's how good this stuff is so when I got the M style boot spoiler taken off um, and the new M4 style one put on which you saw in the video the carbon fiber one it revealed less boot space than what the previous M style did so the whole boot lid had to be repainted once the tiger seal was removed once this was removed from the old um, boot spoiler um, I had to have the boot lid completely resprayed um, because this this doesn't this stuff doesn't come off that easy that's how good this is at sticking stuff which is why this is the stuff that's going to be used to put the the rooftop style window spoiler on the BMW F30 Upol Tiger Seal um, it's it's black Tiger Seal comes in uh, transparent but I've used I'm going to use the black the black one to put this spoiler on so guys forget about using double sided sticky top tape sorry I've got my words mixed up there whether it's 3M style sticky tape or whether it's a cheaper style tape like this please please avoid using this 
because if you've got any type of boot spoiler or roof spoiler stuck on with this, guarantee you, if thieves want it, they'll have it. They'll get it straight away. This is not the answer. This stuff is the answer. Oh, Paul Tiger Seal. So this is what I'm going to use in another video to install that spoiler. So watch this space and I'll show you how to install that rear roof spoiler, rooftop carbon fibre spoiler using the Upol Tiger Seal.